Good afternoon, everyone. It's Dr. Abe Vasquez. In this video, we're going to be discussing the Civil Rights Act of 1964. Uh, we're going to be discussing how it relates to police and criminal justice, and we're going to be doing it under 60 seconds. So let's go. All right. So Civil Rights Act um, 1964, what exactly did it do? So it banded the, uh, the it ended segregation um, in public places. And it banded discrimination of employment based on race, religion, creed, sex, origin, um, and many other things, right? So, specifically for uh, policing, though, and criminal justice, what does that mean for us, right? That means when it comes to employment, we can hire minorities. For the longest time, we had issues of it being a predominant white police department patrolling minority communities. And what does that create? That creates tension. Right. Um, that creates issues with both entities. Now, with the Civil Rights Act of 1964, we got away from discrimination of minorities and employment also uh, with police. And so that allowed uh, minorities, you know, to become chief of police, to become detectives, to become captains and so on, to join the ranks of a police force um, brotherhood, a department of a subculture and so on. What did that do as a result? It eased the tensions. I know it might not seem like that today, but there's more minorities in policing than there was in 1964. Thank you.